This misfire falls on our heads. Silence! Chief Kondo gave us a home after the Mido cast us out of the domain. Assassins like us almost never get second chances like that. Now that we've killed as a president, that crime can only pay for in blood. I get that, but how's what we did a crime? He's got a point. I'm the one who should beg forgiveness, Kamo-san. This only happened because those three were afraid of the Mido faction. And look where their fear got them. Kondo Dono. But what's, what's done is done. So you three are just going to have to die. Kondo. Kondo. Okuita Soji is the most feared swordsman in all of Mitsu Obushigumi. You should even say he's the face of the Mibu wolves. So with Soji cut down like this, the public will see Miburo Shigumi as nothing but a laughingstock, and that would spell our end for certain. We'll lose uh, the Bakufu support and they'll order us to disband. Why should we give a shit? They've got nothing to do with us. Stand down. Koro. Jusuke. How heartless of me. My beloved apprentice is dead. Yet, all I'm thinking about is how to keep the Mirobushi Gumi alive. What's that mean? It means... My ultimate goal is to change this country. All costs be damned. I don't know these words. That's why I fooled the ba Bakufu and built the Miburo Shugumi. For all that to be worthwhile, I'm going to, going to need your strength. I love you too, Greg. I'm trying, man. And the speed doesn't help it. How about it? Would the three of you care to continue with me in another life? On that day, Sarazawa Kamo was reborn as Ino Genzaburo, Hiroma Jusuke as Nagakura Shinpachi, and Hirama Goro as Okita Soji. Kamo-san had only just returned from assassinating Yushida Toyo. So it was him back then. That night, we changed our name from the Miburo Shugumi to the Shinsen Gumi. We leaked a rumor that Kamo had been executed for his ruthless acts and started dressing in flashy blue horori, all to cover our tracks. <laughs> Gorochan here drew the short straw since he became Soji. He was to claim to be a pretty boy like the first Soji was known to be. Then, to make sure this secret never left the group, we wrote the code. Including all who desert the Shensen Gumi shall be put to death. Exactly. It didn't originally apply to every member, though, just the captains who knew the truth. With one simple and fast rule, we were able to ensure all our mouths stay shut, including my own. So that's why. I just had to get my hands on Kamo-san's Mido Tengu style for the Shensen Gumi. The day after he became Genzan, I had him start training everyone at Shiaken in his fight his style. Soon, I decided we'd rename it to the Tenen Rishin style and try spreading it across Kyo, then the rest of the world.
Adaya's idea was to continually recruit the strongest swordsmen in the country. There may, there may have been only seven of us at first, but our recruitment efforts paid off fast. We started getting members like Sanosuke, Takeda, and Ito-san. So, does that make me one of the swordsmen who got picked up to learn Ten and Rishin? Yeah, but it certainly seems to have been mutually beneficial, considering the truth you've been after. Funny how things turn out in life sometimes, huh? Ryoma-san, you know the entire truth of the Shensen Gumi. The masked man you were chasing, that was Sirazawa Kamo, living as Inu Genza Burrow for the rest of his days. Something that tells me you gave me a pretty guilty conscience, Hajime-chan. When Matsubara was about to spill the beans on you, I think Kamo-san cut him down to cover your ass as a bit of a payback. Normally, he was never the kind of guy who'd cut someone down from behind. So Ino knew exactly who I was, but still hoped to cover for me with a Shensugumi? Yep, that's Kamo-san. Always trying to make things right in his own way. Well, anything else you need to hear? Well, there's one thing. I still haven't heard why Inu's son had to kill Pops yet. Nine! Order came down from Mito Domain, said our Dappen would only get forgiven if the job went through well enough. It was the Mito Domain? Does that mean whoever wanted Pops dead lives there? I'm fresh out of answers. Kamo-san never said anything about it, just like you'd expect of a shadowy type. Then I don't know what to do without any leads. Ryoma-san, let me ask you something now. If you were to find out who had Toyo killed right at this moment, would you go and hunt them down? I can't say for sure, but I did realize something when I found out who the masked man was. That is? I haven't been looking for revenge. I'm just trying to learn the truth. That's all. That's somewhat relieving to hear. And if that's the truth, maybe you really are ready for the answer. Hmm? What is it? I knew you were Sakamoto Ryoma because of Kamo-san. He re-added you out basically right away. But that wasn't the only thing he told me. I also learned... The name of the man who masterminded Toyo's assassination, Sakamoto Ryoma. What? Wait, you mean the other Sakamoto Ryoma? You're talking about the Komusa one? Yes. And now he's killed Jensan, his one time assassin. 
Probably just to cover his own tracks. That shit stick. There's more. The inspector recently reported that the other Sakamoto Ryoma has been staying at Teradaya. That's that guy, like, my, our buddy? Really? Has he been there long? I don't know if he's been there as long as you have, but it certainly sounds like Teradaya's got to fill Sakamoto Ryoma's. It's our friend. Our quote-unquote friend. Shit keeps getting crazier. Apparently he comes and goes from the inn for various lengths of time. It sounds like it's a less, at least one of his major ha haunts in Kyo. Also, so you're aware, Ido-san and Ta Takeda's 5th Divisions are headed there now. You already put together a raid? Those guys couldn't stand up in a single fart from the Kamusu Kami cat. The guy took Serizawa Kamo for the first fuck's sake. Yeah, I can't imagine him going down too easily. If they if let him get away, we might not get another chance like this. Yoroma-san, Saito-san rather, I need you to keep playing the captain so you can lend a hand at Teradaya. If you don't catch your imposter before Ido or Takeda do, your chances of solving Yoshida Toyo's murder are going to dry up to nothing. Understood. Kondo-san. Hmm? Thank you for telling me everything. I'm glad he came to the Shinsengumi. Oh, get out of here. Seriously, before it's too late. Right. Let's go. My imposter, he's at Teradaya. Run. Who loves Rod's Rod the most? That's the real question. I mean, Probably gonna wrap up here soon. I'm gonna try to wrap up this chapter. I wanted to stream six hours. I'm like, ah, I'm getting close to being tired. I'm like at 5:50, so we'll wrap it up, and we'll be fine.
手柄の一つや二つ立てんと下に示しがつかんようになってきたか、ま、We almost got our endurance up all the way Really guys? Whatever. That was weird. <laughs> I'm just gonna get rid of these. God damn it. More green balls, exactly. Kutana. <laughs> Kutana. Better than blue balls, Bob. Better than blue balls. Saito-kun. Saito Didn't expect you here. Ito. Ito. The guy from Toso who killed Inoue-san is here. Named Sakamoto Ryoma. We were just about to go get him. Yeah, I know. We need the assistance. Takeda's division and I got it covered. What? You're too green for this. We can't have another slip up here like your stellar performance at Aikidea. That was... Whatever it was, don't worry yourself here. As advisor, I've got command of this operation. Nah, the first is going to take it from here. Exactly, man. Okita-kun, isn't this a real meetup? Bad news, Ito-han. I was just with the chief, and it sounds like he's got something to bend your ear over. Huh? The chief does? Some sort of talk about retirement, I guess. He didn't spell any more than that. All I know is that he wants to get back at the barracks. And then I'm head honcho here tonight. I don't think it'd surprise you to find out you'd be setting yourself up for seppuku. I know my rules. But I also know that you should get to step in considering the chief's asking for his lapdog and all. And that's true, Bob. We tried to get laid and it was sumo wrestlers. Thanks for that. Everyone in the sun knows Ito wants to be chief. I may have stretched the truth a bit, but Samichan should be able to work it fine. And now the coast is clear. All of you and I have got to Okay to kill Sakamoto Ryoma. Good, except there's one thing we should do first. What's it? I want to let Teradai's Okami and Maid get out before we storm the place. They've been awfully good to me. I don't want them getting hurt over this. I get where you're coming from, but how exactly would you do that without blowing the whole thing? Not sure if I could get around the back and signal them somehow. Are you kidding me? I wanted to bust down the front door and start fucking them up while they were pissing themselves. Fine, we'll go with your this around the stupid back. Anything else? No, that should do it. Then let's roll before you make this any less fun. Yeah, I mean it's true, Greg. 
He has too much honor to fuck anyone. Uh -huh. Hmm? You thinking about a quick dip or something? Really trying to live it up, huh? I can hear water. Someone must be in there. Hajime-chan, why don't you peek in there? Maybe it's the Sakamoto Ryoma we're hunting. No, it's Oreo. Well, is it him? Huh? Who's out there? It's me, Oreo. Hajime-san, what are you doing? Listen quick. Does Shensengumi have the inn surrounded? Huh? I guess it's booked here named Sakamoto Ryoma, right? Up on the second floor? Yeah, but what's going on? The Shensengumi are about to storm the place. Find Otos and the others and get out as quietly as you can. The Shensengumi are after Sakamoto-san? I'll tell you about it later. Hurry. Oreo! Sounds like she's off. Well, let's get to work, Hajime-chan. There are men after you, Sakamoto-san. Shen Sakumi's here. Get out now. That's Oreo's voice. What's she doing? No time for answers. Gotta keep the office dance. It's the Shen Sakumi. They're already inside. Now this is what I came here to see. Let's do it, Hajime-chan. Right. He's been betrayed so many times, and he still doesn't fucking... Craig, this game has been up there, like the best of the series, in my opinion. Behind, like, up there with like zero, and uh, I really love Judgment, to be honest. It's not WWE. It's. AW slash New Japan Wrestling. They're just, they're helping me save the world, Bob. Yeah, it's better than WE. It doesn't have Vince McMahon associated with it at all. Point is, is that it, it, what what Greg said is better. Where the fuck did you come from? How can, how come I can chop the other ones, but not the one that's blocking me?
took you long enough. Come on, let's move. I, that's what I was saying, Greg. Plot, I didn't. I'm not used to like inanimate objects having plot armor. It's gotta be our friend dude guy, right? Like, it's gotta be. It's the only thing that makes sense. No, thank you, Bob. I like co find his channel on the other hand. Every time I'm, every time I've been in there and I've like, and I, it's been a couple years since I've ever done that. It like, I, every time I would say something in his chat, it would, I would get. Well, actually, type responses, and I wanted to fucking scream. Well, actually, well, 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 actually, well, 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 actually, well, 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 actually. Old basket head. Damn, our hops has been wiped out by the, just these two. They've got to be monsters. Well, I mean, Bob, I I avoid that and block people on there if I don't. Sakamoto Sensei, don't you worry about this dead meat. Yeah, I block people and avoid them for that shit.
Dude, it's gotten bad since fucking old Elon's dumbass bought it. Da -da. Greg, were you here for the, the vegetable lady who was fucking all the different vegetables? It was something, man. kept asking for vegetables and then suggesting she was gonna fuck him and then you learn later on that she was making stews with him but the game was even like making horny noises and shit Looks like this is going to be a good spot to stop for the day anyways. I think this is going to wrap up the chapter. You're supposed to be Sakamoto Ryoma, right? Who are you really? What's your end game? Why are you using my name? Answer me. Is it our brother? It could be him too. Are you the reason Pops is dead? I think it's the guy, our friend. It has to be you. Say something. Kamasan says hello. Yeah. He has our brother. Because of that burn. It's our brother. I knew it was his our brother. Like, what the? Like, he was shady as shit from the get kill, man. Ajima Chan, look. He bolted through the window. Let's roll, Ajima Chan. Ajima Chan? Yeah, it's our brother. Like I said, it can't be, brother. Stay right where you are. So Sasuke, the Mima Waragumi goon, what do you want? The hell are you two doing here, huh? Ain't it obvious we're after an outlaw Ronin? Yeah, well, we'll take it from here. Because this is officially Mima Waragumi business now. What the hell? Need your hearing checked? I said that Mima Waragumi will be the ones hunting Sakamoto Ryomi. What? Oris came straight from Bakufu. The Sensugumi's been pulled off the Sakamoto case for good. Screw that. Sakamoto killed a Shensengumi captain. You're saying we can't do shit about it? Not my call. You got a, such a bug up your butt about it, take it up with the big man himself. Go see the Bakufu official who handed us the case. Shit! Hey. What's his name? The official who, sa who said you gave the order. <laughs> the Admiral of the Bakufu Navy, Katsu Rintaro. Katsu Rintaro. 
Yeah, may want to let this one go, though. Can't catch every creep sneaking around hiding their identity. Ain't that right, third captain? Ken! What's up, friend? What's up, friend? How you doing? Dude, I was I looked at tickets for fucking um cocaine bear and they were like gone. I never expected the Mima Waragumi to jam up our shit, huh? Hajima san. Thank you for that, Greg. If you're not following, continue. She's fucking wonderful. Go follow her. Make it up. She's great. Follow her. I demand it. Something up? You've been pretty damn quiet here, even for you. Yeah. No, I'm fine. Hmm? Submit up some more stories, you two. Yeah, I did too, Ken. Oh, hey. Itohan and Takeda. Even Heisuki. We getting a party started? Don't play dumb. I know you made it all up, Kondo, planning to, to retire. Huh? I made up what? My memory is not so hot. Quit jerking us off. Your bullshit stun and tear die cost of Sakamoto Ryoma. Gizmo! You've been summoned! Gizmo! You've been summoned! Gizmo! Come on, Gizmo. Gizmo, I'm gonna have to go get him. He's a little shit lately, man. Let me go grab the old bo bozo. Come on, Gizmo. What are you doing, Zelda? What are you doing, Zelda? You're the little brat. You did it to Chloe. I ignored your dad. I ignored your dad. You got summoned for I'm bringing you down here to give you a treat. How the fuck is that? I've had to carry you to give you a treat. I've had to carry you to give you a treat, you little brat. Ken, I was, I was, uh, the picture of, uh, uh, you and, uh, Weasel were, ad was adorable. The baby baby's under the desk now, too. She's like, treat? I would like a treat, daddy. How long does it take you to eat a single treat, my man? He is a sweetie. I can do gizmo treat ASMR. I just give a warning. If you want Gizmo, here, I will give Gizmo a, a treat ASMR, but if you don't like ASMR eating noises, you might turn down the sound for a second. Okay. Gizmo ASMR eating is done. Dude, when I did my birthday stream like three years ago, Greg, I think it was three years ago, I did like, it was every whatever I would do Gizmo ASMR and he would like, we, we had him licking peanut butter off of something. Oh, he's the definition of a ham. He's got these little ham thighs and these ham arms. His arms are so much muscle. I, it's harder to see on camera, but like, it's just like pure muscle, man. He's got these beefy little muscles. He gets so mad. He gets so mad like a baby for beating him up that he tears into her. Hi, buddy. Ken, he's a cool little guy. He's a cool little guy. 
He's a cool little ham. That's why we... Hail Gizmo! Hail Gizmo! And his red rockets. Okay. Here, we'll show you while, while we're in here. Ugh, the baby. The baby. You want a treat, baby? You want a treat? <laughs> Ken, you are always welcome for that. You know that. She followed me down here and got under the desk. Look how long these arms are. I told you, I, I was talking about that the other day, Ken, but I'm watching uh, Trick and Lilith starting Thursday morning for four days. So we're going to have four dogs. I was six dogs running around my house, including three poodles. Look at this baby. Look at this baby. Look at this baby. I'm, so, I'm just a baby. I'm just a baby. <laughs> Basically, OJ. Uh, Zeke's taking Katie to uh to Baltimore for her birthday. So I'm watching the poods. I'm watching the poods. Look at these arms. They're so long. Okay. Uh, let me get my headphones back in and we'll finish up. How do you like an atomic heart, Ken? It looks cool. I, I I hate I hate 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 when games though like are like oh we're like Bioshock is like because you're never like Bioshock and it kind of makes me want the game to be, you know what I mean? Yeah, Greg, you've. You, you've had that luck, man. Well, if it mattered to you so much, maybe you should have stuck around. You're the one who follows Itohan like a puppy, not me. Man, how long is that game supposed to be? The fuck's that mean? Watch your goddamn tone. Okay, let's calm down a bit, Takeda-san. And you know you're just provoking him, Okita-san. What the? Whose side you talking here? Taking here? I'm not here to take sides. I'm just having more and more trouble comprehending Kondo-san's decisions. I wonder, maybe those things could get, uh, start getting easier for us with the Ido-san as head. Hey, Suki, really? Don't bother, hey, Suki. Idiots like him never listen to reason. But get this through your skull, Okita. In the event that I become chief, neither your years in this group or skill with sword will save you. Greg, he's one of my favorite, though. Like, that guy, Ito. Like, he's the guy from Zero, right? Who's fucking awesome. Anyone who disobeys my orders will be silenced. Understood? I just love how he walks around with blood on his thing. If you don't want to be put down like a bad dog, you should think long and hard before your attitude. Hard about your attitude. Yeah. And the pink dude was a prick. I should head back to Teradaya for now. I have some questions for Oreo. I mean, that's gizmo often, you know. Step one, threaten a psycho. Check. <laughs> yeah, they don't realize, man. They are not. I do like, uh, Greg, you are talking about it. He's, like, they're just, they called him the mad dog, just like fucking <laughs> Yakuza. Hey, what's he doing here? Sensei, it's been a while. Ah, Tom, how are you? I thought you were going back home. Still got some time before the ship leaves, so I was just wandering around and I heard you were looking for troopers. Yeah, I am. Well, if you all people need extra guys, I want to help out a bit. I'll be good for training me anyway. That'd be great if you could help out. 
Dude, that fight in the sewers, I think, is my favorite fight in the series, OJA. I think it's, like, the most memorable fight. For, I, like, okay, I, again, I, I've i only played 0, 1, 2, 3 in Judgment, but, yeah. Yeah. Oh god, this little fucking kid. Hey, mister. I'm not doing this again. It's like, like literally the same thing every time. Oh, this is actually a little bit different, but I don't care. <laughs> I know we'll do the trick. My refreshing vegetable salad. I'll bring her one to try. I do think it's funny when Japan makes fun of like Americans like that because it's just like it's so right. It's just so right. No, Greg, no. I did I do love how he calls the samurai the samurai. The samurai. I wanna be a samurai. Damn. Porter. feels like your attack score is lower with the uh the sword only style but whatever check out what how our farm's doing and then we'll come back and finish up for the day random fact i just found out that the well-known song candle in the wind was written by marilyn monroe and not for uh not for lady diana it was written by bernie top and not by elton john <laughs> thanks thanks uh 
I, 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 you didn't know that? I thought, OJ, for a second, I literally thought, I read the blue and how long that was. I thought it was Leaf making a joke. Yeah, Candle in the Wind was, uh, they rewrote, uh, they retuned it for Princess Diana. Yep. I honestly thought it was Leaf for a second with the length of the tweet and the color. OJA and him have the same name, uh, uh, chat name, chat color. You know how it is, Ken. Sometimes you see names and you, uh, colors and names and you just assume. Yeah, I, I, I'm a little bit, I, I know I'm a little bit older than you, OJA, right? So I think I just knew that because I was, I remember the night, uh, she died, man. Me and I had a buddy over, and we were like, you know, being, you know, goofy kids staying up all night. And then it was like CNN had stuff about it, you know. Okay, I really want to know how I get this super fucking kitchen. Yeah. Don't care about the fucking that. I really don't know what I want to do with this. I might be. I might just, no, I don't want to do the ginseng yet. Yeah. Damn it. Damn it, Bob. Well, actually. Well, actually. <laughs> you got to make the vegetable thing for his, that kid's mom. Oh, barely kept it in there, but I did. Okay, so we could give that to the kid to give to his mom. Stupid vegetable kid. Stupid vegetable kid. I think it's kind of bad that we sent her off in the middle of the night to like <laughs> What up science? How you doing, buddy? Good to see you, friend. Okay, let's go finish up this part of the story. How you doing, gorgeous? Good to see you, Science. 
Science, will you touch my butt? Thank you. Now we we're gonna beat up Oreo. Welcome back, Hajime san. Ah, I can guess you want to speak with Oreo chan. Please wait for her in your room. I'll send her up. That little cunt. That little cunt. I was your friend. Be honest with me, Oreo. Why did you help that Sakamoto Ryoma get away? I just wanted to help a guest in danger. He could have been killed here. For aiding one of the Shensengumi's targets, they would have they could have killed you here too. Is this Sakamoto Ryoma the type of guest you should do that for? Risk your own life? Of course. I do the same for any guest which Shensugumi might be coming after. I'd be a failure as a Teradai employee if I didn't. I see. That makes sense. Huh? I'll be checking out now. Huh? You're what? I'm part of the Shensugumi you hate so much. My staying here would only be doing you harm. No, that's not. Thanks for everything. Hajime-san. Come now, Oreo-chan. Isn't it time to come clean? Oh, Kami-san? I can tell. You've got a secret too, right? Why don't we just get everything out in the open? What do you mean, a, a tose? The thing about her is, you're the whole reason she's been even here at Teradaya. Right, Oreo-chan? She's here for me? Yep. She asked me to let her take care of a guest named Saito Hijima. At first, I figured maybe she'd just taken a shine to you, but soon I knew that wasn't all. She'd follow you when you would leave the inn and poke around your room as she cleaned it, looking for who knows what. I'd say there's something funny going on at the very least. Can you explain any of this, Oreo? Have, have anything to do with Sakamoto Ryoma, Han? Oreo chan? You're in love with Hajima san, aren't you? You want him to stay in your life? Then you need to tell him the truth. You wouldn't want the love of your life to have any doubts in you, would you? I understand. I'll tell you everything. This whole time, even before coming here, I've been cooperating with the loyalists. At first, I just reported whatever little rumors I heard around town to Sakamoto-san's people. They told me I was helping out the loyalists and the, the pay wasn't bad. It's my mom. She's been too sick to leave her bed for years. I had to pay for her medicine somehow. But one day, someone told me to follow a man named Sayoto Hijima and report back with everything he does. And that was Sakamoto Ryoma? When and where you were going, who you were meeting, he wanted me to report whatever I could while working at Teradaya. I admit, I didn't think anything of it, at least until that night.
Fist was left here at Teradaya the same day I hired Oryo-chan. I never considered where it might have come from, but now I'm thinking Sakamoto-san. Rewarding me for hiring Oryo as a maid. How did you meet the man in the first place? My father was originally involved in the Loyalist movement. Right up until he got caught in a raid and black Hufu officials killed him, what feels like a lifetime ago. After that, the loyal Loyalist Sheishi started coming to our house so they could pay their respects. Sakamoto-san was one of those people. He was nice enough to help my family when we had nowhere else to get turned. This not, might not mean anything to you, Hajime-san, but when samurai start killing, it's the women and children who are hurt the most. Oryo-chan didn't get involved in this mess because she wanted to. The poor woman simply had to find a way to help her mother. Please don't judge her harshly, Hajime-san. Okami-san. Oryo, I want to know something... No, one more thing. If Sakamoto Ryoma was using you all this time to keep an eye on me, what made him decide to show up here today, of all days? He had to know, have known we'd cross paths eventually. Sorry, I truly don't know the answer. Sakamoto-san did say he had a job in Kyo to finish, though. But that's all he told me. A job in Kyo to finish? Hajime-san, what are you going to do about Oryo-chan? I'm going to double stuff her. Don't worry, Okami-san. I'm ready to accept whatever I've done. Hajime-san, you probably hate me now, right? No. I don't have any right to be mad. I've just confessed to you both. I've been using a fake name. What? My real name Sakamoto is Sakamoto Ryoma. Huh? But that's... Hajime-san is Sakamoto Ryoma? Then, who's the Sakamoto-san I met? That was an imposter who's been using my name. He arranged the death of someone very important to me, then killed to cover his tracks. He was serious connections with the weapons dealers from Britain. And he's my brother. He has the same scars as Takichi Henpita. But isn't Takichi-san? I don't know for sure. My brother supposedly committed seppuku in Tosa. And... I have no idea why I'd want Pops dead. I just... I just don't understand any... anymore. Seppuku. You gotta get those numbers in that box, Greg. Do you want to meet him? The Sakamoto Ryoma I know? What? If you do want to meet him, there's another person in the Shensugumi who knows th that Sakamoto Ryoma. If you speak with him, you might be able to find the man using your name. Who is it? I'm talking about... That little fucker. Inspector Yamazaki Susumu. Yamazaki Susumu. Yamazaki Susumu. He's involved? I mean, he is like the information broker. Okay, that's a great spot to stop for the day.